Stevenson falls to Salisbury tonight, 64-38. Glenn Clark with Coach Jackie Boswell. Coach, obviously offensively tonight, just not really able to get anything going. What, what went wrong tonight? Well, I think we actually let our offense dictate what we were doing defensively. So I really think what really went wrong was the defensive end. Um, you know, when we play really good defense and we get some steals and get some key stops, then it's able to spark our offense. We know that we're really young and we have to work for our offensive shots, but we got to we got to be able to um, gain some experience every day in practice and everything and, and make sure that our defense is the one dictating our offense. I, think, I still think we have some offensive-minded kids, and we really need to have some defensive-minded kids. Three games in, is there still a factor? When you lose a player like who you lost a year ago in Sarah, is there still a, an issue with trying to replace and trying to have someone who steps up when you're used to someone stepping up for the last couple of years like that? Yeah, I mean, obviously, on you know, on the offensive end, you definitely have somebody like that, and there was always a comfortable spot. And so, for the last couple of years, you know, everybody was able to rely on her. But I am very confident in our seniors that they're going to step up. I thought in our win that we had over Houghton, I thought that Imani really stepped up and hit some tough shots. And I thought Christine came up with some tough rebounds. So once those two get really comfortable, more comfortable and really confident in that role, I think they're going to lead our freshmen because our freshmen are really talented. Um, and then, you know, John Ye's struggling a little bit right now with an injury, but I thought she played pretty well tonight too. Um, again, it all comes down to the defensive end and all, all five people have to be playing. And I felt like sometimes three were playing or four were playing and then we just gave up something easy. Uh, one of the positives, I thought there were times where Olivia inside looked really like she was comfortable getting the ball in and trying to go up there and, and either get to the free throw line and get the basket. I think there's a lot of positives to be built on there. Yeah, I mean, even as a coaching staff, we sat there and, you know, she's going to be really, really good. And um, But she is a freshman and she's going against some inexperience. So the positive thing is I, I think back on that NCAA team we had and that those, those group, when they were freshmen and sophomores, we struggled a little bit too. So they just have to um, keep their confidence up. And again, I do feel like Christina and Amani and our other captain chance will keep their spirits up and they got to keep working and they got to realize how hard they really have to work at this level. Back home on Saturday to take on Stevens what do you expect? Um, I expect another good game and then I don't know what to expect <laughs> <laughs> so just don't know what to expect when we're this young. <laughs> Understand coach I know it was a tough one tonight but we appreciate you coming over and spending a few minutes with Great. us. Thank you. She is Jackie Boswell I'm Glenn Clark for GoMustangSports.com.